Hi, I'm Steve Gill with your Daily Notes Video Blast for August 24th, 2011. I love trees, except in the fall when I have to rake them up and clean them out of my yard. But most of us, I think, love trees. Not nearly as much as Joyce Kilmer did with her great poem, Trees. I think that I shall never see a poem as lovely as a tree. A tree whose hungry mouth is pressed against the sweet earth's flowing breast. A tree that looks at God all day and lifts her leafy arms to pray. A tree that may in summer wear a nest of robins in her hair. Upon whose bosom snow has lain, who intimately lives with rain. Poems are made by fools like me, but only God can make a tree. Aw, who doesn't love trees? Well, not nearly as much as they do in Washington, where they spent $500,000, a half million dollars of our money, on a stimulus project out in Nevada, planting trees. How many trees did they plant with a half a million dollars? Well, they planted about 2,000, and they created 1.72 jobs. That's right, less than two jobs with stimulus money that was intended to create jobs, creating less than two jobs with half a million dollars. Now, the head of the project out in Nevada says it really wasn't the intent to create jobs. It was to create trees. Funny, I was thinking the whole project of uh, the economic stimulus was to create jobs. Clearly, that hasn't worked, mainly because they've been spending too much time planting trees and not enough growing the seeds of jobs in this country. $500,000 to plant 2,000 trees in Nevada. That comes out to about $250 per tree. So I went to the website of the Arbor Day Foundation to find out what you could pay to buy trees at a lot less price than what they were spending our tax dollars on in Nevada. You know, you could buy maple trees and elm trees and oak trees and all other sorts of trees for about $5 a piece from the Arbor Day Foundation. And you can even buy apple trees and pear trees for about $10 or $12 a piece. So what they, were they doing with the rest of the 250 bucks per tree when they were using our money to buy trees for about 10 or 20 times what they could buy them from the Arbor Foundation for? I suspect there's a lot of fraud, waste, and abuse in this whole stimulus project in Nevada, but I can bet that Harry Reid is overlooking it. You know, he's the senator from Nevada. Or maybe Sheriff Joe Biden. He was the guy Barack Obama put in charge of ferreting out fraud, waste, and abuse in the stimulus program. Maybe he should start with the trees, you know, the ones they're spending $250 a piece on out in Nevada. I'm Steve Gill, and that's your daily video for August 24th, 2011.